Want the cheapest Xbox and PlayStation accounts on Ultimate Team? Then go check out fifacoinscake.com and use my discount code GOON for 6% off. And if you want the cheapest FIFA points around, then head over to Bactorium.com. What's up guys, Goonies here bringing you a Team of the Season player review. And today it is Team of the Season Paul Pogba, the French midfielder who plays for Juventus. So there's a look at the squad that I played him in alongside some legends and Team of the Season players as well. Remember guys, 200 likes would be amazing. Make sure you're following on Twitter as well. So he's 6 foot 1, high attacking, medium defensive work rate, right footed, 4 star weak foot and 4 star skills, costing his maximum 750k. I did the Hunter chemistry style to him as well. 11 games, 10 goals and 3 assists is what he brought to the table. How's he compared to his upgraded card? Well, you'll see physical's gone up by 7, pace by 8, dribbling and passing both by 10 and shooting and defending, seeing the biggest increases going up by 12. And then when we look at the in-game stats, you'll see that this guy is absolutely immense. 97 strength is outstanding. The only thing that's slightly disappointing is the balance, but that wasn't too much of an issue. Lots of dark green there. And again, with the skill attributes as well, you'll see lots more dark green across the board. Long shots, shot power are maxed out as well, which is absolutely amazing. Look at the hexagon. It's pretty much maxed out in all six. He's probably the most well-balanced card out there. Not a single card face stat under 85. He can play as a centre mid, although he can play anywhere from CDM up to striker as well if you want him to. Weighs 176 pounds. And then super stacked, long shot taker, playmaker, distance shooter, complete midfielder, strength are the standouts. So what are my expectations of this card? Well, when you had a look at those card face stats, I'm sure every single one of you was impressed by those stats and thought, you know what, I'm going to have to try out this card and get my hands on him. And I was no different. Biggest headache for me was where to play this guy. You look at him and you think he's going to be the best CDM in the game. But then with all the other stats that he's got going forwards, it's kind of a waste to play him that deep at CDM, even though he's going to be an absolute monster there. So it's down to you wherever you need his presence to be. This guy will do a job for you anywhere from CDM right up to striker. And yes, he'll be an outstanding striker as well. This guy is faultless. Even with the balance is slightly low, it didn't really make much of an issue for me. Again, you can just toy around with players and then just flip half a yard of space and you can beat the keeper every single time. This guy's shot power and long shots are absolutely insane, both maxed out and you will notice it as well. And then he's such a physical presence as well, he's tall, then he's got ability in the air, strength, you name it, this guy has got every single thing in his locker as well. Fantastic movement going forwards as well, you can always adjust the instructions as well if you want to make him even more of a threat as well. And I thought I'd play him at Cam, because he can drop back to help out with the midfield as well, but also he's further up the pitch and he's getting forward and he utilises all of his attacking skills as well, which is absolutely world class. The 4 star skills and the 4 star weak foot are absolute bonuses for this guy, absolutely quality what you can do with him. It's just your choice where you want to play and that's the biggest headache you'll have with this card is where do you get the best out of him, but the choice is down to you and who, what other players you've got in your team. Worth the coins, 100%. Let's review overall what this guy offers you. He's got fantastic pace, super strong as well. And he's a monster in the air, he's going to win your headers. The shooting and long shots are out of this world as well. Four star skills and four star weight fits amazing. Fantastic range of passing as well. And the dribbling and agility is right up there. I couldn't fault this card at all. Balance wasn't an issue for me. It's the perfect card. It gets a 10 out of 10. Let me know what you think, guys. And if you get hold of him, you definitely won't regret it. So that's it for you guys. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like below, comment, subscribe. And as always, thanks for watching.